All right, let's do it. Five five new subs and we keep keep looping or chi keep changing every five subs. Three, two, one, All right, go. we are starting now. Plump versus Taudi. Wolf versus Yoshi. Let's go. Ooh. Yeah, Plump, uh, yeah, Ivy Q. Plump is still in. And had a really close set with Rage. Game 5. But uh, making, making a running losers right now. Yeah, winner of this plays against uh, Hope. But after this set, we're doing winner's finals. We're doing winner's finals after this set. So, uh, Rage and uh, Whoopi should be... get ready. <laughs> Dude, Tauti is, yeah, refusing to die. Alright, 200 plus, 200 plus. Ooh, good nair. But yeah, saving, saving the jump. It's actually like so good to like when you're upping a side B, you can just save your jump. And even if you get hit, you still have a jump. It makes edge guarding so much harder. Because even if you successfully land a hit, then it's like, oh, they still have their jump. Yoshi's a big boy. Oh, and that emote on top of that. Let's go. Dude, yeah. I, I, honestly, I feel like Plumpus played really good this tournament. I'm kind of feeling Plump. I, I'm feeling Plump is... Yeah. I wouldn't even be surprised if Plump goes all the way. It's going to be hard, this part of the bracket. That many sets and losers, but... Yeah, it really feels like Plump could beat anyone in the tournament right now. Oh, and the mist on the tech as well. All right, game one goes to Plump. No, it's not only Swedish players left. Uh, Rage, uh, he's from Sweden, and he's in winner's final. Whoopi is from Norway in winner's final. Uh, then this set, it's two Swedes, obviously. But the winner here placing his hope from Denmark. So top four will be two Swedes, one Norwegian, and one uh, Danish. This song sucks ass. <laughs> as we said though, as we said, if we get five more subs, five more subs, Twitch chat gets to decide the next song for the arena. All it takes is five, five primes, five subs. And with 1100 viewers, I believe, I believe it's possible. Yeah, the re this remix was actually way worse than expected. Oh, the piranha plant. All right, all right. Plant gang. 
Yeah, every time coffee. Every time. Against Piranha Plant, you actually gotta be very careful with approaching from above. His spike ball is actually so good at handling people approaching from above. Yeah, the, the main issue with Piranha Plant is that it's so many of his moves just have so much lag for some reason. Like, some of his moves have so much lag, lag when you land. His downer takes forever to come out, hard to, like, spike with. His ledge trapping is really scary, though. Wait, uh, wait. Okay, I don't think we had one, but did we have anyone that was uh, willing to, uh, to, uh, work on, like, uh, what is it called? Basically, like, a picture with, like, top eight and, like, place out the people based on their placement and the character and country. Oh, we don't? Okay, I, I figured that was the case. I mean, I probably could ask someone, yeah, like a top eight graphic. I probably could ask someone at Alliance, but it would be cool to... Tweet it out uh, today after the tourney. But otherwise, I can do it tomorrow. Oh, you could Regon? Uh, that would be super appreciated if you could. That would be super appreciated. Dude, I think adding Piranha Plant to the game, it was just like, it was so unexpected. You heard all these theories about like DLC characters, ooh, that's gonna kill. And Plant is heavy. You heard all these like people coming with theories, uh, with DLC characters, no one said Plant. Yeah, what's up, Snow? What's up? Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Snow. Uh, we had like uh, 80, 80 something players. We got a few DQs, sadly, uh, due to unexpected stuff that came up. Uh, but yeah, around, around 80, which is uh, better than uh, I expected. I was hoping for at least 64. Uh, so yeah, 80, 80 ish is, yeah, it was pretty good. Oh, the Bowser. The Bowser is coming out. I mean, this tournament, like, I think, like, at least from, like, watching, uh, I think every match have, like, looked very good for the most part, connection-wise. Almost every. Oh, 
Oh, that would have been a sick conversion. I like uh, Wolf's uh, Shine conversions. Like, you don't see them too often, but it's cool when you do. Oh, ooh, was that? Yeah, it looked like releasing the shield a little bit too early. Oh, he almost caught that. All right, scooping him up. Yeah, Plump uh, on the verge here to qualify for top four. Unless Taudi can bring this back with his Bowser. Oh, that didn't kill. Oh, alright, for the fans trying to do the shine conversions. Let's go. Yeah, we've seen we've seen Plump going for a lot of these tomahawk grabs, but that time it was like tomahawk and then like jump fair to catch the jump instead. That was good. And a two frame with the down smash. Plump advances up to top four. Tauti eliminated in fifth place. Congratulations to Plump. Advancing into the top four where our prices are gonna start.